Hello and welcome to this release video for my new solo album, My Classical Accordion. I will show you some live recorded videos and sound samples and in between talk about the whole production. But why don't we just start with some tastes from Mozart, Sonata in D major in three movements. <laughs> The album title, My Classical Accordion, says something about my relation to this music. It is music I love performing and feel a strong sense of personal bonding with. And for many of the pieces, this is the world premiere recording on the accordion. However, the next sample has been recorded and played by many others, and I would call it a modern classic. Fantasy 84, written in East Germany by Jürgen Ganser in 1984. It is so beautifully resonant, moving and captivating. It has been on my repertoire on and off for 25 years, and even if it's a very familiar piece for accordionists today, I just had so big eager to play my version and include this, one of my absolute favorite pieces ever written for the accordion. As you see, I have a shelf of CDs behind me, not only with my own productions, but also some others. That is because in addition to being a musician, I have a small workshop for repair and tuning accordions, stelling accordions and accessories, and do studio work for recording music. I will just go behind the camera and show you quickly around. So, this room is the main for customers, showing accordion and other goods. In here I have the workshop for repair and tuning. Here I do the waxing and the corner for tuning. And if you go on the other side, ah, here there are some CDs. Diatonic accordions, some accessory bags, straps, accordions. And in here I have my office, also with the music equipment and Pro to Tools, which is my workstation for music. As you see, it is working just now, recording the sound for this video. So in here I also actually play my own recordings, just dampening with some extra walls. 
if I record other people, I use other rooms. Okay, back to the album. I have included two pieces of Baroque music. First, Fantasia in C minor by Bach and a sonata in F minor by Scarlatti. <laughs> I have made many different collaborations with composers through the years. On the new album I have included two of them, which I am very fond of. Morten Gotthev first wrote a concertina for me back in 2004, premiered with the Norwegian Radio Orchestra. Later, in 2014, he approached me with the idea for a new solo work, and the premiere took place in Oslo at the composer's 60th birthday, April 2015. The title, Den som fick høre en latter ugle synge, in English, He who would hear a laughing owl sing, shows Gotthav's sincere commitment as an environmentalist, and the work is dedicated as a symbol of solidarity with nature. The last confirmed sighting of a laughing owl was in July 1924. Here you can see some from the premiere performance, the whole video is available on YouTube. Ronny Kjøsen is a good friend and colleague of mine, who is engaged in a variety of musical fields. Brain Squeeze contains unmistakable references to folk music, but at the same time it has structures of form and harmonies, putting it in the box of classical music. I premiered this piece ten years ago, and actually it is included on this live DVD, which I made with my friend Lars Karlsson, in 2011. So I picked now a short excerpt from this live performance. In the end, I have taken the liberty of including one of my own compositions. As a loving tribute from father to child, I made Hannas Lyckliga Dag, 
Hannas Happy Day. This was a short diving into my classical accordion. Many thanks to Ben Kulset for the cover design, and after myself making the recording and sound mix, Morten Lund has done a beautiful final touch with his mastering job. Of course, I hope as many as possible are interested in buying the album and enjoy it in different channels. And a special tip. Ben Kulset has produced a beautiful music video of the third movement of the Mozart Sonata you can search for on YouTube. Thank you for your time.